Hi, I'm sitting here with Irene Mason, 18 years old, from Tugan on the Gold Coast, originally from Gisborne, beached Esbro. Um, but she's over here in Hawaii, so your second time on the North Shore. Um, what have you been up to, you know? What's been your favourite event on the uh, North Shore season calendar so far? Well, apart from the surfing, <laughs> there's been an O'Neill's Team Challenge Day, and oh, that was really yep. fun. We got to dress up. We did a quick shot. Oh, we went straight to Foodland, got some blow-up things and uh, a <laughs> swimming cap, and we're pretty colourful, our Team Billabong. Yep, I heard you guys were called the Billabong Bandits. Bit of a riff-raff crew of um, all sorts, but uh, yeah, good performance on the day. Um, I hear we didn't come away with the victory. Do you maybe want to explain why that would be, why we didn't, you know, bring the gold home? Well, I think we did pretty well, but <laughs> the O'Neill team, they, I think they might have already decided they had won. Oh, so I um, think it was a little bit rigged, do we? Yeah, I think it was rigged. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> who do you think had the best outfit on the day? You, of course. <laughs> so I'll pay you later for that one. <laughs> um, so where have you been surfing mainly on the North Shore? Look, I hear you've been surfing backdoor a fair bit. Um, why's this been? Well, yeah, I've been surfing off the wall and backdoor, and they're pretty close together. But um, it's been pretty good out there. Just like I think it's the spot for all the hot guys. Yeah, I heard like, the view's pretty good out there. <laughs> <laughs> There's definitely plenty of hot guys out there surfing, and so. Yep. I get to pedal around and just have a perv now and then, but... <laughs> nice, so I like it, I like it. I hear you've, um, you've picked up an, a new addiction since you've been here. What's this? Coffee. <laughs> <laughs> She's picked up the Hawaiian Starbucks addiction, I think, as everybody does. So um, what's, been your, what's your favourite drink there at the moment? Well, this morning I had a coffee tr oh, espresso truffle. Nice, I like nice. the coffees with chocolate in it. Yeah, yeah. Yep. You haven't Good. tried you haven't tried any of the seasonal favourites like the pumpkin spice and eggnog or. I was I'm going for the pumpkin spice or something tomorrow. Something okay. different. Oh, but great. yeah, I love the buzz it gives me. <laughs> <laughs> you did uh, a lot of the QS this year. Can you tell me about? It? Did you enjoy it? Did you get to go to a few new places you hadn't been before? Yeah, I went to plenty of places on the QS like. Um, Place I've never been to, South Africa, Brazil, and some other places like America, and it was pretty fun. Learnt lots, and oh great, yeah. No, it was it was good to see. You had a fantastic year on the QS. You know, just finished a couple of spots, sort of shy of a qualification berth, which you know, first year in is very very good effort. So, um, you're going to continue doing the QS next year. Looking forward to it. Yep, I'm looking yeah. forward to a new start on the QS next year. Oh, excellent. Yep. <laughs> All right. Well. It's Wrapping it up with the Rainy Mason here on the North Shore. Um, coffee addicted, buzzed up, ready to go. Gonna go surf back door, check out the hotties. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> Keeping your plans open, so no. Nah. Ciao.